Roxio Photo Suite has multiple tools that let you remove scratches, straighten, crop, and restore your photos to black and white. Start in Creator and click Photo, and then Edit Photos. Roxio Photo Suite opens. In Roxio Photo Suite, click File, Open, and navigate to where you stored the photo. Click the photo, and then Open to load it into Photo Suite. Every photo has different problems. This one has scratches that need repair. It's faded, was scanned in at an angle, and the edges are ragged. To repair the scratches, make sure that you're in Fix Your Photos tab and click the Scratches tool. As the directions say, zoom into the image, resize the brush, then brush over the scratch until it's gone. Then repeat the process with other scratches. Click OK to close the dialog. Now let's correct the fading. Click Exposure to open the Exposure window, and then click Auto Fix. Photo Suite analyzes the image and adjusts the exposure as necessary. The image is still a bit dark, but you can easily tweak the settings. Boost the bright areas to about here, midtones to about here, and dark areas to here. Once you're satisfied, click OK to close the window. Now let's straighten the photo, which was scanned in at a slight angle. Click Straighten, and then find an object that's supposed to be horizontal or vertical. This right edge works well. Click on top, then down here, and then click Straighten. Photo Suite straightens and crops the image, but the edges are still ragged. Let's fix that. Click the Crop icon. As you can see, you can crop to any shape or for any print size. Custom is right for this job, so drag the corners and sides in until the ragged edges are outside the crop lines. Click Hide Cropped Area for a better preview. Then click OK to crop the photo. Now let's eliminate the sepia and restore the photo to pure black and white. Click the Enhance Your Photos tab to open PhotoSuite's Photo Enhancement filters. Click Special Effects and choose Black and White to reveal those effects. You can experiment with the different looks, but here let's use simple Black and White. Double click to apply and click OK to close the dialog. Then click File, Save and save the file as normal.